Welcome to this week's Fastest Minute in Construction. I'm Nate Beck, Daily Reporter Staff Writer. Let's dig into the news. Forget asphalt, it appears WisDOT is paving the roads with cash near Foxconn's incoming Mount Pleasant factory. Brownsville-based Michaels Corp won two bids this week totaling nearly a quarter of a billion dollars for road work near the Foxconn site. And on one $80 million contract, Michaels Corp beat out Chicago's Walsh construction by just $700,000. There's more work on the way. WisDOT will let another road work project in June and the village of Mount Pleasant close bidding this week on a job demolishing properties in Foxconn's wake. In other news, a contractor working on Milwaukee's charred Trinity Evangelical Lutheran Church was working without a proper city permit before a fire broke out there May 15th, causing some $17 million in damage. City officials say contractor Langer Roofing and Sheet Metal didn't have a permit to work on the historic 140-year-old church like the city requires. Langer Roofing, meanwhile, says it is working with the city to, quote, determine if a mistake was made. We leave you with more tragic news this week. On Wednesday, a C.G. Smith employee repairing a downtown Milwaukee parking garage died after he was pinned between a concrete beam and a scissor lift. The Milwaukee County Medical Examiner's Office says the death was likely accidental and plans to perform an autopsy on Friday. C.G. Smith, meanwhile, says it is devastated by the incident and is working with investigators. That's it for this week's punch list. We'll see you next.